What's up guys, how's it going? I hope you're having a good day. Welcome back to another video. Today I'm back from my bathroom. I'm going to be showing you guys how I clean my beer with the safety racer. And in the process, I'm going to be reviewing the Bevel Shape System Racer Blades. So I just got into using a safety racer about a year ago. And um, you know, just like everyone else, I was tired of paying those ridiculous prices for, this other, for the other brands or for the other racers out there. And um, I just thought that using a safety racer was so, so much cooler, you know, it just, and um, I wanted to try something different and um, save some money in the process. So um, what a lot of people say is that you have to kind of just try out different racers, um, I mean different racer brands and see which one you like best and which one works for you. And um, I saw these, so I picked them up. Again, you get 20 blades for $10. I picked mine up from Target. Um, I'm not sure if you can get them from another store. I haven't really checked, but um, yeah, so let's get started with the video. All right guys, so what I usually do is um, I like to shave right after I take a shower because the steam is gonna help relax your pores and soften your skin, and that's gonna allow the blade to glide through your skin much, much easier, and you're gonna get a better shave. What you can do is you can just wet your face with not hot water, but warm water because hot water will damage your skin so you want to just get it ready by just uh, splashing a little hot water and uh, getting those pores to relax okay so now that you wet your face um, what a lot of people like to do is they like to use a pre-shave oil um, to help with the shave um, I don't like to use it because I just don't feel like it makes so much of a difference that I have to use it um, it does help a little bit but um, at least for me I don't think it's worth it Okay guys, so now we're gonna apply the lather, but a uh, quick tip, what I like to do is uh, before I hop in the shower, I leave this soaking in uh, warm water. That way when I get out, it's nice and moist and it just kind of gets the brush ready for the shave. And um, it just, I feel like it does a better job of applying lather on your skin. So that's what we're gonna do. So you want to apply your lather, so that's what I'm going to do. Okay, so once you apply the lather, you don't want to shave right away. You want to let the lather sit on your skin for a little bit. That way, um, you know, you get better protection because you let the lather kind of like sink into your skin a little bit. And, um, you know, you're going to get a better shave. Okay, so once you have your blade inside, you want to run the safety racer through hot water. That way it heats up the blade and you, um, I just feel like a hot blade makes for a better shave. Okay, now the way that I um, that I get the lineup, I don't like it to be too perfect. I like a little bit of imperfection. Um, I just feel like that gives it a more natural look. But um, it's really easy. What I do is I just grab a, like anything that's pointy, for example this, and I kind of just do this like this and connect it to this part. So basically connecting this to this. And you want to make it real quick like a little foom. Same thing on the other side, you know, you connect this with this and you go, you go foom, right? Okay, there you have it. You kind of get like a little line. So once you make the lines, you want to go and shave with the grain first pass. The bottom, what I like to do is I kind of just, I like to start with one side and then I'll just show you guys. Okay, so what I did is I started with this side and now I'm just kind of like gonna reflect it. So basically just what I did on this side, do it on this side. The way 
that you get, um, you know, you get it to line up. It's kind of just practice until you get it. That's really how I do it. And now we're going to do a second pass. And now we're going to go against the green. So now we're done and uh, what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna wash my face. Now that I wash my face, I'm gonna go ahead and dry it. And you don't wanna like dry it like this, okay? You wanna just pat it. Doing this, it, it's like you're scrubbing your skin, that's not good. So just, you know, just pat it. Now that I washed it with warm water, what I'm gonna do next is I'm gonna finish it with a splash of cold water. That way the pores close up. Once you're finished, what you want to do is you want to apply some aftershave balm and um, if you don't have this then you can just use like some face moisturizer that's going to work fine too. And now you're finished. Okay so I came over here because there's better lighting. Um, but I just want to show you guys how it came out. Okay, so now let's talk about the blades. Um, they work pretty good. As you can see, they did a pretty good job. And the price is amazing, but they're not my favorite just because I like a sharper blade. But if you want to get them yourself, I will post a link in the description to where you can buy them. I'm also going to add another link to the description so if you want to start using a safety racer or try it out I'm going to recommend a kit that you can get started with. That's the one that I actually started with. It pretty much comes with everything that you need for a great price and um, again I'll have a link in the description. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, make sure that you subscribe. Just click right here. That's pretty much it for this video guys. I hope that you enjoy it. If you like these kinds of videos, let me know by liking it. And um, yeah, see you guys next time. Peace.